Mike here, aka Red Eight Miner, and welcome to a new episode of Red How To. Today we're going to be tackling the Wither and making a beacon, a full beacon. So, how is this going to happen? Well, what you need to do is you need to go into another, and then you need to go to another fortress, and then you need to start attacking with the skeletons. And eventually they will drop their head. Uh, the chances are real low without a loot or fortune enchant on your sword. So I recommend getting the highest enchantment of fortune 3 and spending some time in another fortress. That's where they spawn and you need to get 3 skulls. You also need to have 4 skull sand. That's just a backup wither. Uh, I have a wither station over there and other things you're going to need. Um, good diamond armor. This compared to the Ender Dragon fight, you're going to need everything that's in here, except for the diamonds. You're going to need um, diamond helmet, diamond full diamond armor. I do a mixture of blast protection, protection, torch exile protection, and protection. Um, a smite five sword, yes, smite five. That's actually good against. Um, I just realized I don't have arrows. Uh, good against uh, the wither. Okay, sorry about that. Yes. So, uh, a power five bow with infinity is helpful. Um, golden apples. You're gonna need golden apples. Uh, splash explosions of strength. Uh, six is kind of a short recommendation, but hey, don't skimp. Um, if you can afford it, make the notch apples, which is gold blocks instead of gold ingots, and an apple in the middle, and surrounded by eight gold blocks. But uh, you should be able to do it with normal golden apples. Uh, strength potion twos, very helpful, especially when you get to the second stage of the wither. You need some skull, and I need some meat. So let's go do this and watch me die a countless number of times. There's a lot of ways of doing this. Um, the best way to do it is just to fight him. Uh, so when you first start out, you know, fight him. Uh, if you don't feel comfortable fighting him out in the middle of the open air, because he does have a tendency of traveling, I do recommend fighting him in a cave somewhere. There's actually a cave right there. I'm going to have to find another good spot. But here we go. Here he is. You set it up in a T-shape like so, and you place your head on top of the T-shape. So I recommend starting this off. Well, hope you guys are ready. I sure am. So let's do this. And hop. Uh, Chug the apple. And hey, come back here, you stupid. Wait for it. And first stage is only bows. So wait for him. And he's gonna aggro other things, so you need to keep in tabs with him. He's gonna go after. Yeah, this is why I made sure I had two different. Um, come here. Two different. Um, yeah, withers. I'm thinking about finding a freaking cave to defeat this guy because he's over here shooting at cows, not at me. Come here. There you are. And he's easy. Good. And now I'm with her. The reason why I take Flash Post is a strength is because once he gets to the second stage. Oh, pardon. That, that would. Haha. Uh -huh. One way to get wood. Come on. Chug another apple. Um, red generation potions would be effective. Come here. You get regeneration with the golden apples and absorption heart. Okay. What is it with me trying to do a how to video and not turning out the way I want it to? Come here, you stupid wither. Leave the cows alone. Focus on me. There we go. There we go. Come here. Come here. Come here. Okay, he's in the second form. Make sure you got the last version. Here we go. I'm not gonna pull. I can't get you. I'm here! Okay, uh, there we go. And 
that's it. And we got the Withered Star. Uh, yeah. Recommendations, do this somewhere with a close, confined area. You don't... <laughs> he won't run off on you. So, as you can see, it took me almost all six apples. Um, and full protection armor, smite five sword, and infinity, and power five bow, and chasing his butt around the forest over there. So, we're gonna... And this is on normal, by the way. All this is on normal. So, um, oops, I don't know why I just did that. I wanted to set it to day, not set the, yeah. And I said day. Not do that. But anyways, uh, also recommendation, don't do it near your home. Don't do it near your home. Do not do it near your home. Whatever you do, don't do it near your home. Um, so let's head off over to the area where I'm going to construct the beacon. And this has actually gone a lot better than the dragon fight, but not much because it did decide to go off into the forest to kill woodland creatures. And poor woodland creatures. But, uh, yeah, um, I sped up too this time, too. <laughs> but yes, um, definitely the notch apple would probably have been a lot better, but like I said, you can get away with just normal old golden apples if you can't afford a golden apple, but you got uh, gas tears, regeneration potions will work, but you don't get the absorption of hearts, which take, which is an extra two sets of hearts, and well, it will work, it just, it's gonna hurt a lot more, so now that we got the nether star and dirt, and hamburger, and uh, seeds, and whatnot, we're gonna show, I'm gonna show you how to make the beacon. Uh, what you're gonna need is three pieces of obsidian, and five pieces of glass and a crafting recipe like such and you get yourself a beacon well a beacon is not going to do you much good without a base and I said this is going to be a full beacon and a little shout out to uh, Pain X Tiller uh, another YouTuber happy to follow and I'm actually kind of doing this tutorial for him but I'm also doing it for all you guys I uh, he asked I need some help and what to do in my Minecraft Let's Play, so I said, why don't you defeat the Ender Dragon and defeat the Wither and make a full beacon, and if you want to make it harder on yourself, do it out of all the materials that you can build a beacon out of. So, the base is going to be a 9x9, nine nine. so we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and I'm being nice, but you don't have to do it all in iron. I mean, all in different iron. You can just do it all in one thing. So, I'm going to do the base in iron. It's going to be iron, gold, diamond, and emerald. As you can see, I have that all in my inventory. So we're going to build the base. The base is, again, 9x9. Nine nine. Okay, let's just finish that off. Okay, and the next layer will be gold. And the gold is 7x7. Seven so when in doubt, um, you'll have one little lip off per level. So that way you can know. It's going to look like a pyramid when you're done. So that's another thing. Make it look like a pyramid. And you can make a beacon with the base of just the standard top base, which will be made out of the emerald. And the next will be 5x5s. Five five. All that diamond and emerald is going to be in there. And then emerald, of course, which is a 3x3. Three three. And then we place the beacon on top of that. Cha. Got ourselves a beacon. Oh, I got the glass. Okay. So you could just do this base, but you won't get all the cool power ups. And then you can do the next base and so forth. So let's see. What are we going to choose? Well, I didn't grab my diamond. Who's got my diamond? I didn't grab my diamond out of this chest. So anyways, or it could be an emerald, or it could be gold, or iron. Okay. So what you do is you click on it, and you place your diamond down here, or your emerald, or your iron. And now you can choose what power-ups you want. I say I want strength 2 and regen. So it'll give me, or strength 1 and regen. So, and I hit the done button, 
and give it a few seconds and as you can see my heart starts boosting 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 gives me regeneration and strength effect but another cool thing is if you're in minecraft 1.8 you can actually color the beacon voila see the red glass right on top we have a red beacon so guys i hope you enjoyed this on how to defeat a wither boss on red's how to this actually went a lot better than i expected i expected to die a lot more than i did but wither is not that hard uh, recommendations again keep yourself kitted out real well find a cave somewhere away from your home set up the set up the wither there have plenty of tools that you're going to need to defeat this thing and spend the time trying to get it so like, i hope you guys enjoyed um, i sure did uh, leave a like down below uh, subscribe if you want to see more uh, leave a dislike if you didn't like it comment down below on something i may have done wrong and if i didn't do it right you can always comment down below and uh, hope you enjoyed i'll see you next time and this has been a reds how to defeat the wither excuse me tongue in the ear see you later bye